what is regen? What is regenerative agriculture? It's a question I get asked all the time because there doesn't appear yet to be an agreed definition that um, everyone is happy with. So regenerative farming is a it's an ethos really isn't it it's not a set of rules it's it's and it's so individual it's it's an ethos where you're looking to regenerate regenerate the soils and really understand a complete cycle of farming so you need to be balancing um, and and creating healthy soil creates healthy plants creates healthy animals creates healthy food I think, it, I think it is wider than just the soil. To us, I think there is a social aspect as well. Um, for me, I, I think about um, making sure that we're educating people, employing local people, um, as well as it being about um, the soil, the hedgerows, carbon, sequestration, the animal welfare, yeah. the people working on the farm. It, it's, it's the whole thing. It's looking at the whole farm and looking at what, what you can regenerate in the farm. It's been seen as very niche and unique and not relevant for, for the mainstream. But I think with the challenges that we've seen coming, the realising that actually some of that stuff is relevant for the mainstream and how can we, how can we transition that? And I think that's where um, Arla has a u unique position um, because it's farm owned, so they can be the ones driving the change. And then kind of being key and owning that conversation with customers about why Regen is great and what, what change is happening on their farms in order to have for food produced in a better way. We're really lucky to be in the position we are, that we, that we have the opportunity to make um, a positive impact on the environment. With Regen, a lot of it's a collaborative approach, so I think there's no better way than to learn for farmers is to learn from other farmers doing it already. So I think pilot farms would be a great opportunity to share knowledge and, and be able to see it in action. As we learn more about regenerative agriculture, then um, it's likely that we are going to get some sort of um, agreed practices and principles. It won't be a set of um, criteria that every farm can do, but there will at least be some shared knowledge. Yes, I think farming can definitely be a solution to climate change, not to be seen as part of the problem. If we follow good agricultural practices, I'm confident that climate change can be something that's positively driven by farmers around the world.